Hi, I'm Laura. Welcome to Coon Craft Yoga and Design, and welcome to week one, day three of our January fitness routine, just 10 minutes to a new you, and 10 minutes of trying something a little bit different every single day, because honestly, we get tired of the same workout routine. So you're going to find a variety, upper body, lower body, hips, hamstrings throughout the entire month, Monday through Friday, a new video every day. Hit subscribe now so you don't forget and you get the notifications on these new vids. So today is just 10 minutes and it's all about core. And we are going to go ahead and get right into it. Join me on the mats. We're going to come right to the center of the mats and take a boat pose. We're going to start off with balancing on our sit bones and draw the knees to a tabletop position. You can absolutely have your hands down to help you balance onto the mat, or if you want to have them out in front of you, that is fine as well. And from here, we're just going to tap with the toes down one at a time. Staying strong in the core. Also, this is still a warm up for the hip flexors as well. Sometimes this can be difficult into the hips. So keep in mind, we're not just working the core here. The whole body is working. The back body is working to keep you stable and to keep you upright. And the hips are working. Using our coordination, tapping one toe at a time. And we'll go for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. All right, from here you can hold it right here. We're going to do about a 30 second hold or you can extend the legs out for your boat pose. Hands out in front of you at prayer. If you really want to go for it, you can extend them up to the sky. You're going to really feel it there, but we're going to hold. I can already feel myself shaking. I've already done about two workouts today, taught two classes. So I am already feeling this. Just breathe through it, stay strong. Make sure you're not starting to slump into your back or round into your back. Keep the balance. Bring the knees to tabletop if you need a little bit of a break. And we'll hold for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. We're going to lower down to low boat slowly. Wonderful. And then come up. Use the core. You can bring the knees to tabletop or if you want to straighten out the legs and come all the way to full boat, you can. But we're going to lower down to our low boat and then come back up for two. We're going for 10. Lower down. Come up for three. Lower down. Come up for four. Lower down. Up for five. Lower down. Up for six, lowering down for seven, and eight, and nine. Maybe the last couple we can straighten the legs, we'll try. And then 10. After the 10th one, we're going to lower down to low boat, and we're going to hold in low boat for about a 30 second hold. Can you do it? Stay strong in the core. It's getting hard to talk. <laughs> Holding here, reaching with the hands. Breathe through it. Smile. You got this. And when you're ready, draw the knees in. Bring them into your chest. And we're going to roll ourselves up. Bring the hands just slightly behind the glutes. Place the feet out so they're about a hip width distance apart. We're going to lift up the hips. Take a little stretch. 
in our reverse tabletop, maybe rock it forward, stretch out the shoulders because that can feel good. And then we're gonna take some pass-throughs with our glutes. So keep it strong into the hands. We're gonna rock back onto the heels. Keep the butt lifted as we lift and draw the butt through the arms and then lift it back up to reverse tabletop. From here, we're gonna go through for two and lift. Pass through for three. Stay strong, draw that jelly, belly button back. Pass through for four. It's gonna be a little bit of an arm workout as well because of course it takes some strength into the shoulders. That's six. Lift up with the hips. Eight and lift. Nine, reach it back and lift. Last one, and lift. And this time we're gonna pass it through, but stay lifted into lift our glutes up off of the mat. Can you lift the left leg and hold it for five, four, three, two, and one. Lower it down. Can you lift the right leg and hold it for five, four, three, two, and one. Lower it down. Lift the left leg, hold it for five, four, three, two, and one. Lower it down. Last time, lift the right leg, hold it for five, four, three, two, and one. Lower it all down, draw the knees in. Maybe drape yourself forward, bring yourself in between the legs. You can tell I'm winded. This is a pretty intense upper body even, and also a strong core workout. And when you're ready, we're gonna come back to the center of our mat. We're gonna take 10 more low boat to high boat moves. And, with, and we're gonna finish off the whole thing with one hold into our boat pose. So if you're ready for it, we're going to lower down, extend the legs out, and then lift up to boat for one, lower down, and lift up for two, lower down, and lift up for three, lower down, lift up for four, lower down, lift for five, lower down, lift up for six, lower, and up for seven, lower, and up for eight, lower, up for nine, lower, up for 10, and this time we lower, and I forgot I had one more pose I wanted to do, so let's come onto our forearms. We're going to keep the back lifted, keep the chest lifted, bring the legs up into the air, and we're going to do just some scissor lifts with our legs. If it's too hard for you to keep your legs straight, you can also pass the legs with the bent knee and do just like this. Moving the legs back and forth from left to right for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. We're gonna come back up to a seat and take that last final hold in boat. So wherever you're at, if you want the knees to be bent and stay right here, you can also hold onto the legs or you can have the legs extended. We're gonna hold for about 30 seconds. Stay mindful, find your focal point. You got this, we got about 20 seconds left. Last 10 seconds. And release. Very good. Maybe fold the legs, drape the torso over the legs. And maybe a couple of twists just to wring out the core. Pretty intense, pretty fast. 10 minutes, maybe even less than 10 minutes, but I bet you're feeling it. And if you want more, hit play again and come back to this. Find me on this series, hit subscribe, and as always, have a wonderful day. Make it a good one. Bye.